Hi, I'm Michael from Sand Dragon, and I'm here in Italy with Cristiano De Simone. Yeah, and we're going to demonstrate, demonstrate different techniques to defend yourself when being attacked from behind. So he goes for the headlock. First of all, I'm gonna put my chin down, both to make sure I can breathe, and in case he's gonna do any hits, I'm gonna be blocking them with my forehead. Then I'm gonna go for a strike, and then I'm gonna break his balance here, and I'm gonna sweep him to the ground. Now if I want to, I can do like a lock or something, but the primary thing is to just get away. He put me in a headlock. I follow his movement and turn my back, grab his hand and put him on my knee in a very uncomfortable position. After that, I free my neck and gain the control of his arm. Left my hands uh, over his elbow and blocked this in this position. After that, I remove my knee from his back and turn my body in the opposite position. Like this. Very good, just go. Okay, so the key thing is you want to bring the chin down and your shoulders up. That way you have time to breathe. Then you're gonna try and strike him somehow, like a headbutt, or it could be using your heel or something. But a good option is your elbow. To make sure you hit, you wanna do it in a diagonal direction, like this. Then you have time to step in behind, and you're gonna strike the person down, and then most likely you're just gonna run away. But if you like to, of course you can do all kinds of things. He tried to catch me. Immediately I put my chin in this angle with my hand. Blocked his arm with control and left my feet. Here, elbow in the, in the ground and hands and the back of the knee. I simply fall down like this. I put him in that. Open his arms and I can run away or I can capture his legs like this using my body for a strong level and block his, his body with the other arms. If he try to make something, I can hurt him in the solar plexus and capture his breath. After that, I have the conclusion in my head.